Canary Historical Society announces an expansion. They hope that it will help preserve this area's history. And News 9's Nick Robinson is live in Wausau with why they chose to grow their operation and when you can expect to see the new and improved exhibits. Since the Marathon County Historical Society was founded 70 years ago, they've been collecting artifacts and preserving the county's history. But now things are starting to get a little cramped, leading them to announce a new expansion earlier today. We're just completely out of room. That's the sentiment shared by many at the Marathon County Historical Society. So they announced they'll be putting seven and a half million dollars towards a two phase expansion so they can store more artifacts and better preserve the ones they have. The plan is to build a 30,000 square foot building just north of the Woodson History Center, along with a 6,000 square foot garden to be named after the project's biggest donors, John and Carolyn Sonnentag. Society leaders say the move was necessary to keep things going. We have nowhere to store Marathon County's history anymore. So in order for us to do, um, to preserve, further preserve Marathon County history and meet our mission, we need more space. This switchboard from the Mosini Telephone Company was, as staff put it, the straw that broke the camel's back. It was the last item they were able to fit in here until they realized they needed to expand. Officials who helped to plan the expansion say they pull officials who helped to plan the expansion said they pulled out all the stops to make sure artifacts are kept in good condition. They'll notice by us if something is getting too warm. The last thing you want is a fire, but if one happens, we want to be able to uh, take care of it. We want to be able to also just target the spot where the fire breaks out. You don't want to get water on on everything you have. The society's president, Russ Wilson, said that this new facility will have everything it needs to store artifacts for years to come. We'll have space for the acquisition of artifacts for the next 50 years. When exhibits are switched out and new exhibits come in, uh, there is a lot of work. The Sonnentag Legacy Center is expected to break ground next spring. Officials from the Historical Society told me that all funding is coming from private donors so taxpayers can breathe easy. Live in Wausau, Nick Robinson, News 9, WAOW.